Hi, and welcome back to the Envision Home At Last video series. Recently, I met with Tim Mueller and Jenny Knutson to talk about interior selections. I'd like to share that information with you. Hi, I'm Jenny Knutson, cabinet specialist here at Envision Home At Last. When meeting with you, initially, I like to find out who you are and what your daily habits are in your home. We will go through and discuss your wants and needs and all your ideas, whether they come from magazines, the internet, or verbally. We will go through and go discuss options such as full extension soft closed drawer guides. And another common option is rollouts in base cabinets. From there, after we have your layout ready for design, we will go into selecting cabinet options and species as well as colors. There are many species to choose from, from hickory, alder, oak, cherry, and maple. There are many styles to choose from, such as raised panel, flat panel, and beadboard. Painted or stained, we are sure to have something you will like. From there, we'll move on to selecting your countertop options. From granite to quartz to solid surface and laminate, we are sure to find something for your budget. And let's not forget your cabinet hardware, which will be needed to finish up your cabinet project. Hi everyone, I'm Tim. Uh, today I want to talk with you a little bit about interior uh, different pieces that you need to choose to complete your house. Uh, first we're going to talk about trim. We have base molding and we have casing. Uh, the base molding, as you can see, will come in different sizes different uh, species, you can get different stains, as well as the casing. Uh, the base goes along the wall to protect the bottom of the wall. The casing goes around your window openings, uh, possibly door openings. Really what you're looking for is price, function, does the style go with the rest of the house. Uh, pricing. There are different species. Some, some are going to be harder than others and usually more costly. Uh, styles, you want something that's flat, more plain, or something that has more of a design to it and more profile to it. Uh, do you want stain, which comes in many different colors? Do you want painted, which you can also do in different colors? So moving on to stair parts. There's a lot of things to think about, again, form, function, price, style, species. Here we have some options that you could choose from. Again, painted, stained. If you have, let's say, a long, curved stairway, very elegant, you may not want to go with a simple pine baluster. You may want to go with something that's wrought iron and more decorative. Everything needs to work together and flow throughout the house. So here we go. Another piece to tie in with everything else to make sure your styles, colors are all working together. We have door hardware. Uh, we'll focus specifically on interior doors. We have a lot of different styles, as you can see. There are a lot of different finishes. And again, you want to tie everything together. So looking at uh, a lever style handle, versus a knob style handle. Some are more contemporary, some are more rustic and go with different styles better. Uh, as you can see, if you have a stairway that's close to a lot of doors, you may wanna go with a, a wrought iron baluster and tie that in with a, with a finish like an antique bronze lever or knob. Uh, everything needs to work together. Style should go together what makes you comfortable and what's gonna work in your new home. Next up, we have interior doors. A lot of different designs to choose from, a lot of different species, colors, paints, stains. They all work together into what is the price point for the door. So just to show you some different options you have, uh, we look at species. We have pine, more of a flat panel design, very simple may work well in a rustic type home. We have a six panel door in an oak. Very durable, heavy door, solid construction. Maple, another simple door, 
different graining pattern than the oak doors. Again, does it work with everything else in the home? Does the style complement the styles of the other pieces on the interior? Uh, we have an arch top here, different style, different price point. Going to a masonite door, which is more of a composite material, painted look, uh, hollow core, different price point, different style. And a flush door, no panels, hollow interior, different price point, probably your best price point to choose for uh, interior door. Really, again, does it work with all the other styles in the home? That's what's important. As you can see, there's many decisions that need to be made regarding your interior finishes, and I hope you found this information helpful. If you found this information helpful, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and visit us on our website at envisionhomeatlast.com. We'll see you next time.